if you're walking, why don't you go with somebody? Uh, you don't tend to text and not pay attention to your surroundings if you're with someone. The number one thing is just paying attention to my surroundings. And when I don't feel safe in a situation, if anything looks questionable to me, then I do something different. If I step off of the elevator when I'm in the garage and it's late, I'm by myself. If I don't feel right, I feel something creepy or weird, I will definitely hop back on the elevator, won't think twice about it. Be aware of my surroundings, who is around me at all times. Have easy access to my cell phone as much as of a distraction that could be. I'm not using it, but if I need to call someone, I, want, I don't want to be digging through my purse. Our security team is fantastic and is always available to, for an escort if needed. Krista Banks, an RG employee, good at her job, conscientious, reliable, yet she left herself vulnerable. What did she do wrong? She was just walking to her car after a long day. Personal safety isn't just nine to five. Keeping safe goes beyond the NRG workplace and can depend on something as simple as being aware of your surroundings. Let's see a few things Krista could have done better. <laughs> So, what do you think of the new guy? He seems to know his job. And Joyce thinks highly of him, and she's a good judge. <laughs> so what's up for tonight? Uh, dinner, mm -hmm. call my mom, uh -huh. explain to her why she doesn't have grandchildren yet. <laughs> you know, the usual. Yeah. Yeah. You? Um, tickets to the ballet. Oh. Yes. I swear, dragging that man <laughs> to the What was that? Uh, probably just some alley cats looking for scraps. You're probably right. Yeah. But hop in anyway. I'm driving you to your car. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> oh, a great productive work day. What a good day. It Amazing is. day. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh my God. Turn oh. on the lights. You know what? Turn on the lights. Yes. Turn on the lights. <laughs> Light a candle. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't so spooky, was it? Here's what Krista got right. Whenever possible, go with a friend or call security anytime you feel you're going into a place that may be unsafe. Trust those feelings. If something feels out of whack, there may be a good reason. Krista also wasn't burdened by carrying a lot of stuff. She kept her hands free and she had her keys out. She was also aware of her surroundings. Finally, Krista locked her car doors as soon as she got in. We're not saying that you should be worried about walking to your car. We just want you to take some simple precautions. That's it for now. See you soon on Ripple Effects.